typically, I, like I said, I do get them from gifting tweets that are geared for celebrities, but they're usually um, pro hair dryers or high, you know, high end consumer pro hair dryers, and they do make a difference because I'll tell you, my old hair dryer took longer for me to do, and Let's see, it took longer and made my hair drier. These new ones do not take as long and then they make your hair feel better. Actually, they're bringing them around over here to me. Oh yeah, these are, they've got the tourmaline ones. Yeah. I was trying to remember the word, yeah. This is a, a tourmaline hair dryer. It's yeah. used on her hair and Monty's fur. And it does make a difference. I've noticed it on Monty's fur when I do it, or on uh, my hair. I mean, usually if I don't have to blow dry my hair, I don't. Or if I do it, it's just for like a few seconds, you know, or a minute. You but know, Monty's hair has to be blow dried, totally all the time, because uh, it. What happens is, it will if you're not blow drying it and brushing it at the same time, it will knot up on you. Mm -hmm. Think little. If, if, think of your family, your mother, and you've got a daughter. And she's got long hair. You understand? Well, Ma Monty's hair takes a lot longer than mine because part of it is my head. This is my head. Hers is all over her body. It's yeah. not as long, but. <laughs> but it's still the same process with the think. The, think of a, a like a, a seven, eight year old daughter, with a with very beautiful hair, and you're basically really doing this is what you do with her hair. So. Mm -hmm. So after that, there's a couple different things that you can use. This is a, a serum. What is this? This is an anti-age therapy serum. And if you use the same analogy that you use for, yeah, you're going for your face. Yeah. These serums really do make a difference. You uh -huh. notice this is different. This one's a cream, and this one's a serum. The hair is the same. Okay, your fingernails come from hair. Hair is just basically, I think, like 97 percent of the human body is covered with hair. Mm -hmm. It may not look like it, but everywhere on your body is hair, and if you don't treat your hair well, you're not treating your body well either. And so what this does is to enhance vibrancy and to color each strand with your hair. Now part of it, you see how much, see how much is in there? <laughs> I'm looking, you're looking at that like, do you ever use it? Okay, yeah. I've had this for two months, yeah. and I literally do a squirt, and I'm looking at it going, I probably am not using enough. Yeah. Because I have this for two yeah, months. No. But I only use it every time I wash my hair on this one. Yeah, but we're going to honestly tell you something. Generally, the best hair stuff that we get always goes to Monty. She isn't getting no, any but, of this. Okay, She's I not getting any of this. That's true. I have not been sharing any of it. But, you uh -huh. know, here's part of it is I do use this every time I wash my hair. Yeah. I do not wash my hair on a daily basis. I no. do it based on when it feels like it, it, it needs it to It feels be. yucky, then she does it. So. Mm -hmm. But otherwise, it, it doesn't because part of it is, is the more you wash your hair, right? Yeah, more she's you... got a problem with dry skin to begin with. So, if the more you, the more you do something, the more drier it's going to get on her scalp and everything yeah. else. So. Yeah, and part of it is, is I also do use a very expensive hairbrush that I did buy. But it was one of those things that I cared enough about it that it's like I did all the research and then bought a. Um, and then bought a, a hairbrush. Yeah. Right? But it did goes a long way, to put it this way. Actually, I've had that hairbrush for a long time. I have. A very long time. I got my stuff the same time she got hers, mm -hmm. and I still haven't basically. It's just like, you you know, <laughs> you know, you just put a little bit in the palm of your hand and it goes on. At least it's, that's the way it's worked with me, a little bit and it goes a long way. Which means it sort of makes up for the cost because it does I know, go further. And, and yeah, because you think, oh my gosh, it's that much. It's like, well, it really does go a very long way. Yeah, but well, generally speaking, this would have been gone in two months. I'm laughing at this one too because I've had this for two months, and I put some on, it's, and it's literally. Yeah. Well, because you have an eyedropper. You no, know, it off. doesn't. If it's an eyedropper, it just it goes farther, and a well, spray thing goes farther. And part of it is, is I have long hair, so I'm putting it on from here to here, but. They probably want you to use more product faster. Yeah. No, <laughs> like, but it should be like, the, the fact that it's being, you're using it. Like, and I think that doing hair is probably the same as like you were cooking. You take the original, um, you know, the original how it's supposed to be done and make it work what's best for you. Yeah. And then when you go in to have your hair redone again, they'll make up 
what you were doing. So. Well, that's part of it is if you go into a professional that really knows what they're doing, they'll advise you on what to do with your hair. See, part of Yeah, it goes a long way. You just look at it all. Yeah, I, yeah, I just it. wiped off what I had on the uh, end of this, the bottle. When it's all over, mm -hmm. it's still on her hands because <laughs> that's how far it goes. So. And this has argon oil in this. This is their India oil. Yeah. And this is to strengthen, detangle, give you smoothness and shine. And I've had this also for two months, and it's like, I did not put that lid on right. You know, I mean, I could have done it from the male side, but males generally, no, it didn't work. There's, stuff works for a woman, works for a guy. Guys probably buy more hair care products than women do. You think so? Yeah, because men have more problems with hair than women do. Oh, I never thought of that. So about they're all trying to basically take what they got and make it look better. Well, and part of it is, if you ever look at women that have absolutely gorgeous hair, they're probably doing something different than you are. Not to say that what you're doing is not right, but they're usually, besides shampoo and conditioner, they're probably using special um, treatments, like if they're using hair dryers, blow, um, blow dryers, or hair irons, or anything like that, they use another just, product. Just remember the old commercial, don't blame me because I have gorgeous hair. Mm -hmm. I do this and you don't. Mm -hmm. See, that's the, that's the whole thing. And truth. then the oils do make a difference. Good. Um, and um, we're going to go to the, and this is not being a, a knocking any product. We use the Monty analogy. Monty has to have oils for her hair. If she doesn't have oils for her hair, her hair basically really, she looks like her alter ego little girly bow wow, you know, the tough dog. But no, it, don't. Treat your hair any less than you would treat your dog's hair. That's always, I always am amazed by that. That what, people would spend thousands of dollars for their hair on their dogs and then go over and spend well, seventy five cents. Shows. <laughs> no, no, don't, no. The average person. Do I, they really? I don't vet folks. Okay. And they will spend, they will spend just literally thousands of dollars a year on their dog's hair, and then go to Walmart and spend a buck twenty five for a shampoo for themselves. Well, you know, part of it is I started learning how to cut Monty's hair because I, I had this issue with spending more on having my dog's hair cut than mine. Yep. <laughs> so I learned how to give her a haircut. Yeah, but Monty is a show dog, but Monty also is, I mean, I know dogs over by where I live where the people go in every single week to have their dog's hair done. Every week. They wash it, oh, flop really? it, and have the hair done every week. 52 weeks a year. And wow. And that you know that they, they don't go into a hair place to have their done, but the dog goes over to the dog salon. Mm. So it is. It really is a matter of uh, fact. I, when I was in veterinary school, uh, they they specifically pointed out to us, and he said that the, the teacher said he said he said oh, oh, he tell you he said women out there he said you know like young ladies. You shouldn't treat your dog better than you treat yourself when it comes to getting your hair done, which is basically was trying to tell them they all really had bad looking hair. <laughs> and they got they come in everybody comes in with your pets and, and the pets look like they've you know, like the, they got a dog that basically, you know, was an all American dog and had a five hundred dollar hairstyle on it. Oh. And then she comes in with her hair looking like it. You know, she's been, you know, sort of, uh, you know, the bee, you know, the, the hornet's nest look, which is sort of everywhere, so. But I will admit, Monty does have some special things that are added to her food for yeah. her coat and her skin. Um, and then also things like uh, flaxseed oil or salmon oil, which actually are, are great for your pets, but they're also great for you and they do make a difference. Yep. I mean, the, the couple of other things that I do is I do go out in the sun, which you know, because we go out to the beach all the time. I do drink whole milk, yeah. which helps with the vitamin D, and then occasionally I do take skin supplements for my hair yeah. and my skin. Yeah. Um, but but it all starts occasionally. But a lot of your hair starts with the products you put on. It the does. Hair. It starts with something like that. Well, and you know, part of it is, is I've learned if I do all those other things and I don't use good hair care products. It still doesn't really yeah. work. And, you know, you like, need all of them together, or actually, at least the hair care products on the other. The other stuff helps make a difference, but I, I actually really think that the hair care products themselves are more important than the other. Yeah, but like we, you know, like nowadays because of our, of our, because of the administration and office, you have to tell people, you know, that this is, you know, it might not be an unbiased review because you didn't pay for the product. But the problem is, is that people have seen her in this hair. By the time this is on for two months, mm -hmm. and we've basically we've took shots of her with the hair, 
after we've, after we've been blasted by drifting automobiles, which basically throw stuff. We've shown, shown her, you know, after, you know, after she's been a week out at the Grand Prix, mm -hmm. after she's been in the desert for days doing stuff, on the beaches for weeks, mm -hmm. and we've taken pictures to show you that it's actually as it is. It, we've, you know, we've not enhanced anything to make it look like that. That's the way it looks. And yeah, we've got lots of pictures and video. All, all in different situations, yeah, because part of it is when we're out there, we're really busy, and I don't have time to mess with it. I really yeah. don't. Yeah. I mean, this really is kind of a, a wash and wear hairstyle, and it just has made it really easy. I mean, part is they did give us these products, and they did yeah. work on my hair. But yeah. I will also tell you that if it didn't work, we wouldn't I, do it. Yeah, I wouldn't be sitting here talking about it separately, because you know, part of it is I'm I just tell you how I feel about it, and that's yeah. what I feel. Can we tell them the truth of how we do things if? if we don't slam products. The way yeah. we don't slam products is we just don't report on it. Yeah. We do not report on something that we didn't, that we don't like. If we like it, we tell everybody we like it because I don't feel it's my place to give anybody and, you know, to attack somebody. <laughs>